fast according to the Bible. Fasting, as taught in the Bible, is a powerful spiritual discipline designed not only to abstain from food, but also to deepen one's relationship with God. Here's a guide on how to fast according to biblical principles. 1. Set your intention. Before beginning your fast, clarify your spiritual goals. Are you seeking guidance, repentance, healing, or spiritual renewal? Setting a clear intention helps to focus your mind and spirit throughout the fasting period. 2. Choose your type of fast. The Bible mentions several types of fasts, and choosing one that aligns with your physical health and spiritual needs is important. Absolute fast, refraining from both food and water. This type of fast is very intense and should be done for a very short period and under medical supervision, if necessary. Partial fast. This involves giving up particular foods or eating at certain times of the day only. For example, you might skip meals during daylight hours or abstain from specific types of food like meat or sweets. Daniel, fast. Based on the prophet Daniel's fasting experience, this fast involves eating fruits, vegetables, and whole grains, and bread. This is a healthier option for those who need a less intense fasting experience. 3. Keep it private. Matthew 6, 17-18 emphasizes the importance of fasting in a manner that is not apparent to others. The focus of fasting should be on your relationship with God, not on displaying piety. Anoint your head and wash your face to appear not to be fasting to others, keeping your focus on God who sees in secret. 4. Incorporate Prayer and Scripture Fasting should be accompanied by prayer and reading the Bible. These practices enrich the fasting experience helping you to grow in faith and hear God's voice more clearly. Use this time to meditate on scripture and engage in longer periods of prayer than usual. 5. Reflect and Act Fasting is also a time to reflect on your life and act on the insights you receive. It can be a period of making amends or offering forgiveness, performing acts of kindness, or helping those in need. This outward expression of inward change can be a powerful part of your spiritual journey. 6. Break the fast wisely. When your fasting period ends, reintroduce food gradually, especially after a strict fast. Start with something light and easy to digest to avoid shocking your system. 7. Seek guidance. If you are unsure about how to fast or what type of fast is right for you, consider seeking guidance from a spiritual mentor or a health care professional, especially if you have health concerns. Fasting, when done according to biblical principles, is not just a physical discipline to insights and closer communion with God. It's a journey of faith, humility, and renewal 